Pinfield. I'm hosting 120 Minutes tonight, and I'm sitting here with Lush and Mickey and Emma. Uh, one half of Lush are joining us right now. And uh, you have a new album out called Love Life. And, um, you know, going back, we I mean, you first put out two EPs on 4AD over in England, which were Scar and Mad Love, which all did really well here in the States on the import. And then it was combined into an album. Then, of course, Spooky and Split. Um, I mean, you've done a lot of things over time. You've been in the States. You did Lollapalooza a few years back. Yourselves and the Mary Chain were the two British bands on that tour. Um, what would you say? I mean, after all that time, a lot of things have changed over that time. Definitely the sound has gotten more direct and more straight on and kind of in your face. What would you attribute that to? Well, I think on this record, we try to sort of capture more of the live energy of the band. You know, our previous, well, especially Spooky, was a very studio album, very, uh, quite overproduced, and we tried to get away that from that a bit with Split, but I think with this album we've really um, captured the sort of energy of the band or stripped it down a lot, taken the effects away and, you know. And just been given a real direct thing? Yeah. You worked with uh, Pete Bartlett. <laughs> Tell me a bit about working with Pete um, and where you found Pete. Well, Pete's done our live sound for about five years now. So considering we were trying to get capture the live energy of the record of the of the performance, you know, for the record, it's a fairly obvious choice to work with someone who knows the band inside out, gets on with them really well. So we co-produced it with him. Easiest record we've ever made, most fun we've ever had, you know, and it was just it was, you know, really good atmosphere for sort of creating stuff and it was fun. Yeah, was a lot of it written beforehand? Um, it was most of it? I mean, did you know yeah. how it all was going to sound when you went in? Pretty much. I mean, we usually do that. All the songs are pretty complete yeah. before we get it going. Pete was great, though, because he came up with a lot of really good ideas for guitar sounds. Right, because he works with you all the time mixing, exactly. right? Exactly. And, perfect. and he's a Deep Purple fan, so <laughs> what more can you want? Exactly. He's listening to the Highway Star. Right? Yeah. Okay, we'll have more with Emma and Mickey in just a bit. We'll be right back. But right now, we've got a video off their album known as Spooky. Here's For Love. 120 minutes and lush. Second 60 of MTV's 120 minutes. In the next hour, we'll have a special live performance from Oasis, a brand new one from Sturm. I hope that uh, I'm pronouncing that correctly. And the latest from Stabbing Westward, Foo Fighters, Starfish, and lots more. Sitting right next to me are Mickey and Emma of Lush. Um, you know what? Right now in, uh, in Britain, there's there's been the whole Brit pop scene, and a lot of things have happened over the last year or so. You know, with Blur, of course, even though it's their third or fourth album now, actually fourth. Um, you know, I mean, there was a big. Uh, they they got really huge over the last bunch of years. Oasis came out. Alaska. There were a ton of other bands. Do you find? How do you feel that affected Lush? Do you think that it had anything to do musically with the band? Um, because of that whole uh, pretty much straight ahead pop thing. I mean, would you say that, that affected your writing at all? No. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, we've always had quite a lot of pop songs. Yeah. Um, maybe due to production, they were maybe not as obvious as they might be on the, this new album. Um, I think we've always sort of stood outside what's sort of fashionable yes, at the have. time, and that, I think that might have contributed to our longevity, actually. Right. <laughs> Better off jumping on the bandwagon, right? <laughs> We're going to come back with some more questions that are relevant to Lush's music, so don't go away. We've got more we're coming up with them right now, though. Let's kick things off with a brand new one from the Red Hot Chili Peppers. It's the third video of One Hot Minute. And Flea's daughter, Clara, and her classmates do a great job in this one as uh, little airplanes. And here's Airplane, brand new one on 120 Minutes. With the first clip off their second album, Wither, Blister, Burn, and Peel. That's Stabbing Westward with What Do I Have to Do here in 120 Minutes. I'm Matt Pinfield, and what I have to do right now is talk to Lush, because they're here. I'm psyched. Mickey and Emma are here. And uh, you did a new video, which people are going to see now for the first time, which is really pretty stunning. I mean, you look great, and it's just, it's, it's, you worked with Mark Pellington, who worked here years ago, but has done a lot of other things. How did you hook up with uh, Mark and, um, to do this video? And uh, was he someone you were interested in having work to work with? Um, it's always really difficult for us to pick, like, you know, video people. I don't really actually see that many videos, yeah. you know. Right, so you end up getting sent stuff. And eventually what happens is the people who are really enthusiastic about working with you is, you know, obviously, I don't really go after people that who aren't, who aren't really interested and stuff. And Mark was really, you know, oh, I really want to make this record, I really, you know, I do this video. And so he sent us his stuff. I didn't realise he'd done that whale one, which I'd always mm. really liked. Which one, the Hobo Hobo Sobo, babe? The, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. they're sort of yeah. racy, yeah. Which I thought was great. So that was it. I mean, the only problem was we had to go to Los Angeles to make it. We were really busy at the time, and it was a matter of flying out there and having dinner and discussing it and then making the video the next day and then flying home and, yeah. you know. But it was, they were really nice people. Yeah, and it came out really great. I mean, people are really going to enjoy this. We're going to show them right now uh, the video, in fact. It's really cool. And we'll have more with Lush in a minute. Right now, here's their brand new video off the album Love Life. Lush with Lady Killers on 120 Minutes. Back to 120 minutes. I'm Matt Pinfield. Here are Mickey and Emma from Lush. The new album, uh, Love Life, is uh, it's cool. It's got a lot of interesting themes on it. It's um, I mean, you got lady killers, single girl chow. A lot of it seems to have to do with relationships, ones that you are going to war awry, or just the matter of dealing with them. Tell me a bit about that. Boy, how you came up with that for this record? Yes, Emma. Tell us a bit about that. <laughs> oh, I don't know. We're not that cynical about relationships. No, a lot of people have accused us a bit of being man-haters, but it's not like that. I think a lot of it's actually quite light-hearted and tongue-in-cheek. Um, as light-hearted as you can be when you're telling someone to get lost forever. <laughs> <laughs> it's just easier to write about. I, mean, I don't know, do you do this? If you have an argument with someone, you walk around with it in your head till you win it, you know what I mean? So it's easier to write about things that are sort of constantly on your mind than you know, we've been in love, we've been happy people, yeah. but then you just do it, you don't write about it. Right, exactly. <laughs> but you have to get those other thoughts out, and then maybe you're helping other people out by uh, checking out your song lyrics and getting ideas exactly. on how they can deal with it, you know? Exactly. <laughs> it's a really cool, upbeat, and energetic album, and I really like <laughs> it, and uh, just want people to know that uh, it's out, it's coming out, Love Life. Um, and Thanks for coming by. It was great to have you again. Hopefully you'll be touring here real soon again as well, right? Yep, April. Cool, very good. All right, well, I want to thank Mickey and Emma for coming by here. And uh, right now we've got a new video from the band Stum. Okay, they're a four-piece band from Ireland. Have toured with Therapy in the uh, the UK from their debut album Grow. Here's Skydiver from Stum on 120 Minutes.